Hello, everybody, and welcome to Chrono Plays the Arcade Block. This is Nerd Blocks Arcade Block for January 2015. I have to get that correct because I did get that wrong in the last one. The last time I said it was January, and it was Nerd Block, and everybody expected that January's classic Nerd Block, whereas this is the Arcade Block, and of course it was for December. This one is the January one, and it is the arcade block, and I'm just being clear because I tend to screw things up like that. Now, before I begin, I notice something really weird. So I get this in the mail today, and I pull it out of the little bag it was in that was hanging on my mailbox, and I think, oh, this is actually in pretty good p condition. You know, there's no real damage or anything like that. Good show, USPS. And then I actually read the bag, and it says, Dear Postal Customer, we sincerely regret the damage to your mail during handling by the Postal Service. And, and it just continues on with blah, 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 blah. Um, but, uh, seriously, there's, like, no damage to this thing. So I am very, very, very confused. It's actually good condition for once. Yeah, I don't know. Whatever. Mm. Anyways, so we have our arcade block. It is in the same Nintendo-esque packaging as the last one with the same Konami code tape, which is kind of cool. Um, yeah, nothing different at all about this box from last month's box. So... I guess we just skip the box itself and dive directly into what's inside. So here we go. Let us open this thing and find out. This time I actually covered up the packing label before I opened it, so I have absolutely zero idea what's in the box. So, a boy in his block. It is the same exact box. Though this one was better printed, though. I noticed the... Uh, the Colors are actually aligned properly, unlike the last one, which wasn't. They were all off. All right, so here we go, the arcade block. We have a t-shirt, and it's gray. It is, let's see. Donkey Kong with They See Me Rollin', They Hatin'. Ooh, this is a nice shirt. I know I've said that the last time, but this is a, well, okay. Not really. There's a pretty nasty thread right here that you probably can't see on the camera. But there's a giant, giant thread hanging off of this thing. Just have to trim that. Hopefully that won't tear or anything. But that is a nice shirt. That is a really nice shirt. Looks warm, too, except for the fact that it's been in the mail for the past several week Or, well, days. Week. I don't remember. Um, so, yeah, okay. That's a nice shirt. And I caught that one, too. <laughs> Ah, on top of the box, we have Retro Genesis Classic Button Packs. We have Sonic. We have, I believe that's Ninja Gaiden. We have... Oh, what's that guy's name? Joe? Oh, that worm guy. Oh, I played his games. I don't remember the game name. Oh, I feel kind of stupid. And, of course, they included Battletoads here. Good, good close-up picture of these guys. Yes. Uh... I cannot remember his name. I cannot remember his name, not for the life of me. Hmm. We have a Tetris notebook. Wait, this looks familiar. I know why this looks familiar. Okay, um, my nephew gets the child version of this, the, the, the Nerblock Jr. for boys. And the first month he got this, this was in it. So this was in the uh, Nerd Block Juniors. Interesting. Um, but I know what it is. Basically, it's a notepad. Come on, open up. I was going to say, I recognize this thing. Why do I recognize this thing? It's because I've already seen it before. Uh, basically, what it is, is just a notebook uh, that uh, the pages are kind of shaped like the blocks. And that's about it. It's interesting, but yeah, yeah, yeah. 
I don't write mesh notes, but it's still kind of cool looking. Boop. In here, we got a, ooh, it's a Lego, uh, oh God, how long has it been since I played Halo that I cannot remember the name of this vehicle? Uh, but it's Mega Blocks. Um, I have a Spartan figure from Nerd Block, I believe. Looks like that guy right there. Huh. I don't remember, but yeah, it's uh, one of the flying vehicles. One of the Covenant flying vehicles from there. Now, is it? Yeah, we got these guys. I remember them. Um, yeah. I remember seeing them. I remember getting them before. I don't remember when, though. Uh, Covenant Ghost. That's it. Okay, that's it. Uh, so, yeah, it's a Mega Block Ghost with a Covenant Soldier or a Spartan in it. Well, I'll put that together in a little bit. Uh, next on the list, we have Plants vs. Zombies Time Apocalypse. I'm not sure what this is. It is a comic book. Or a graphic novel, since it isn't exactly a comic book era. But it's a comic book based off of Plants vs. Zombies. <laughs> okay, that's funny and actually kind of interesting. Um, I'm actually going to have to read that. That looks like it'd be funny. I don't know, I'll take a look at it. Plants vs. Zombies gets another serving of hilarious plant-filled zombie zapping comics. For the records, I don't play Plants vs. Zombies. I kind of find those kind of games silly. Uh, Crazy Dave, the babbling yet brilliant inventor and top-notch neighborhood defender, helps his niece Patrice and young adventurer Nate Timely fend off Dr. Zombo Zombos's latest fun dead invasion in Plants vs. Zombies Time Apocalypse. Okay, that's enough of that. That's enough reading on camera. I'm not good at it. Yeah, that's that's actually kind of cool. I'm going to have to read that. Hmm, further down, we have... Uh... Stickers. Okay. So they're just random gaming stickers. We got uh, Scorpion. We have... I'm going to guess just a zombie... Actually, they all kind of look pissed off and zombified. Hmm. Uh, Star Fox. Really, really, really pissed off Star Fox. Alien Link. <laughs> Severely distorted Alien Link. We got uh, Sub-Zero. We got uh, Vault Boy. And we've got uh, Big Daddy. Specifically, I believe the... Actually, I think it is specifically Big Daddy, not Rosie. Uh, the one with the drill, not the weaponry. Oh, and then there's really, really pissed off Zack Boy. <laughs> Okie dokie. And there's something else in here. It is... Oh, yeah, this is the... Ugh. I have two of them. Basically, this is what's saying what's inside of it. So the Mega Bloks Halo Ghost, this month's block... Or this month's block, choose your side with the rapid attack Covenant Ghost set by Mega Bloks Halo. Whether you're a UN UNSC Spartan recruit or a Covenant Elite Zealot, you can still have fun building and playing with these Halo collectibles. Now get out there and win the war, soldier. Does that mean they have both? Well, like I said, I'll have to take it apart and play with it. Uh, then we got the Tetris Notebook, which, like I said, I saw before. The Plants vs. Zombies comic. Uh, the Sega Buttons. The Gorilla Stickers. Ah, that's why. Well, it actually says Playful Gorilla, and I totally didn't read it. And then the shirt, which appears to have three different colors. I have the light gray, but there's like the kind of like a midnight blue, and then there's a black one. Uh, you know what? I like the gray one. Uh, the blue one would be cool, but I like the gray one. I like the brighter one. I have plenty, plenty of uh, black t-shirts. And yeah, that's the same thing. Anything else in here? No! That is it for the arcade block. And that's actually really cool stuff. Okay. Um, yeah, that's pretty neat. So I'm going to go build a... Mega blocks thing. I keep wanting to say Lego, but they're not Lego, they're Mega blocks.
And there we have it, our little ghost flying ship. And I think it's actually pretty cool looking. Um, interesting little choice on the details. We have the weapons up front. We have these weird wing things that look backwards to me, but I think that is right. Um, yeah, and then the little clear parts here are just so they can sit on there and be it can like float kind of thing, which is pretty cool. And they give you a choice. They give you the uh, Spartan, or they give you one of the elites. And uh, this one's not doing very well. His head isn't on. You know, it wasn't put on very well. <laughs> Tried to jam it on there, but it doesn't work very well. Um, as you can tell. Ooh. Okay. So you're, like, <clears throat> yeah, you're given a choice between a Spartan who does have the ability to stand up on his own and an elite who seems to not really have the ability to stand up on his own. And they give you the Covenant Energy Sword and the Assault Rifle. Uh, as you can tell, I put them on the wrong ones because the energy sword is by far my favorite weapon in the game ever since they hit, added that in Halo 2. Um, I actually own one. I do. I have it hanging on my wall in the living room. Uh, so, yeah, that's pretty cool. The instructions weren't terribly easy to follow. Um, it doesn't really help that they were there and I'm the whole way over here and my eyes kind of suck. So, yeah. Um, few spare parts, not a lot. I'm not missing any parts, which I qu always qualify as good. So there we have it. We have the Nerd Block Arcade Block January 2015. Hopefully I put that up on the YouTube title properly. I will see you guys in the next episode, and as always, keep playing the game, and have fun.